Thursday High News Time, 845. Happy Friday, everybody. You know what that means. It's time for the web delivered in plain English. Brought to you by Dave Naves of Dave Works. It today is Google Plus. Good happy Friday, Dave. How are you today? Good morning, Sarah. I'm fantastic. Thank you for asking. How are you? Oh, fabulous. Looking forward to a great weekend ahead. And uh, I was just complaining to you. I need to reconnect with Google Plus. I accidentally unconnected and I miss it. You'll have to fill us in on the very latest with Google Plus. <laughs> it is a really cool thing. It is a really cool thing. I, I think so. Oh, I'm, I'm so glad you say that because, you know, so <laughs> often people don't think it's very cool. People well, yeah, it's scary. It's a little intrusive at first. It can be intrusive, uh, but uh, it's a social network, you know. You want to come to the dance? You got to dance. That's right. So we have the future, man. <laughs> it is the future. So um, like most of the shows, I'm trying to break this down in uh, plain English. It's very important to me that I, I get my uh, – my uh, my nerdiness out of the way and try to just explain especially in the in the format of business why this stuff is important so i'll break it down into exactly what it is why it's important and then how to use it all in the spirit of of business I, even though it's it's social and it can be very personal i i'm into business on the web and doing doing social can Doing and being social on the web can make you a lot of money if you do it right. And I believe that small businesses are the backbone of our economy. And I don't like, I don't like the inference that, that big business rules. And the, the web is the great equalizer. I've believed that for the 22 years I've been doing this. And it, and it still remains true. So, anyway, I'll get off my little platform there. Well, it's, a, it's easy. It's a way to really uh, join in the community and be a part of the community for small businesses. Uh, who are on almost equal footing with the big boys when it comes to social media, right? It's 100% true. They're, especially with Google and search engine results, everybody can win. Mm -hmm. There's enough room for everybody. And uh, the fact of the matter is big businesses, <coughs> excuse me, big businesses often have employees that honestly don't often care too much about the big business. Whereas small business, it's a different story. Hmm. Small businesses have people working there who really do care about the business, oftentimes even in the micro businesses, they care very much about competing and they are nimble and they can, you know, shuck and jive <laughs> just as good as, as anyone. And, and they can make their, have their own uh, footing, if you will, in mm -hmm. this invisible yet very powerful network. So anyway, so Google Plus, what is it? it, it created a, a long while back, actually. Um, it's a game-changing social network. Think of Google Plus as Google's Facebook, okay? Mm -hmm. Facebook's still probably the most powerful social network in terms of how long people reside on there, how long they, you know, they stay and, and, and converse with people. But Google is Google. Google, you know, think, think of it this way. Where do you go when you want to look up information? It's not the yellow pages anymore. <laughs> right. It's, it's Google. It's Google. Mm -hmm. Where do you want to go when you want to party and have fun and see what your friends are doing? That would be Facebook. Mm -hmm. So in the spirit of business, if you were ignoring Google+, Plus, you are missing a lot of sales. You are missing a lot of money. Is it intimidating? No. You know what's intimidating is probably the, uh, the stigma you may have attached, attached to Google+. Plus. Mm. So Clear it, it up for us. Okay. Let's, let's just do the set. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, Google+, Plus. it really is a game-changing social network. It makes sharing on the web far easier with much less noise than Facebook, okay? Um, how is it a game changer? Google's the most popular search engine in the world, and anything you post publicly on G+, uh, is indexed way up on the search results. Mm -hmm. So if you wanna get found on Google results, right, in standard searches, you better join Google Plus and start posting. You mm -hmm. can post the same stuff. Um, and it, it, is, it, it works very much like, like Facebook. Some Almost easier in some cases. I would agree. I would completely agree. The um, you know, instead of liking something, you plus something. Mm. Sharing is sharing. Comments are comments. But there are <clears throat> many things that Google Plus offers that Facebook doesn't. Um, specifically, Hangouts. Hangouts, which is going to be a future show here, um, is an amazing um, tool that, that Google offers through Google Plus and Gmail. But it is video chatting. Think of it as Skype, mm -hmm. right? They. And you could do it with up to nine people at a time, wow. which is pretty amazing. They, 
Last video week. with nine people. Yeah. Wow. It may, so you want to have like a family conference? You want to you know get together with friends and family? Boom, you're done. Business, absolutely. Video conferencing, it's huge. It's so incredibly easy to use. And one of the the best features that I like about it, they've just embedded it into Gmail. They've embedded it within. Remember we talked last week about Google Voice. Right. It is Google Voice and Google Hangouts are almost the same. Huh. Te- technologically, no, but. You want, to, you want to call somebody, you call them through Google Voice, and if they happen to have a, a camera, you're video chatting. Uh-huh. It's all embedded right there. And little things like, uh, I'm going off on Google Hangouts because I love it so much. Mm. You can automatically record. You can automatically record mm. your, your session and then post it to YouTube immediately. Oh, I like that. Pretty amazing. Huh. Yeah. So that's, I'm going to make a, an entire show out of, out of that one. But it is uh, incorporated deeply within Google+. Wow. Um, circles, uh, G+, plus circles. Google really takes uh, segregating and combining your friends uh, very seriously. You can – Facebook offers this as well, but a lot of people don't take advantage. They just get a mm-hmm. bunch of friends, and they, you know, they talk um, to whomever. They post something. But Google takes these circles. You, pay, you place people into circles, businesses and people into circles, so you can ca- – organize them. Mm-hmm. So if you want to talk to certain people and not others, you can do it easily. There was actually a really cute commercial once explaining this where a, a, a guy was liking a girl and this girl had her circles divided into whatever she wanted to name, but she called one Creepers. Mm. And on down the line, and this guy kept bugging her and was really liking her. And this commercial was really sweet in the fact that she kept moving this guy into different circles. So she, he went from Creeper to Keeper. Oh. And it was very sweet. <laughs> they finally got together and they, and they got married. Very oh, sweet wow. commercial explaining how you can move people around and how you can organize your friends because it can be overwhelming. So mm-hmm. um, especially when it comes to tagging and all that, if you want to market to specific segments, uh, you can mm-hmm. with with very easily as you post something on Google Plus it'll it'll ask you who do you want to post to and if you have your circles your your divisions already created you can say I want to post to you know this circle only or this combination or publicly whatever like family or the baseball team exactly. or work team exactly right neighborhood crew exactly right so yeah. they take that very seriously and I really appreciate that because the more organized you are with your social networking the more money you're going to make mm-hmm. right so um They've got so much. Uh, it's fully mobile. Google Google Plus is, is seriously mobile. So, uh, like you said, you, you've got to reconfigure your phone, but mm-hmm. it is well worth doing, mm-hmm. uh, especially if you start maybe implementing some of the other things I've talked about. You know, even Gmail, uh, Hangouts, um, Voice, all the things that Google offers. The Google, Office Google, tools that, that Office, you can drop Microsoft for. There you go. Mm-hmm. Google Drive right there. Everything is is all there in front of you, and and it's free, by the way. Mm-hmm. Um, what else? There's so much to talk about. Um, they've got tons of games, although in my blog post I said, well, think Time Waster. I don't believe in games. I, I, you know, It mm-hmm. might be fun for certain people. I'm into business. But they do have a vast assortment of games, and you can play uh, with your friends and family if you want uh, on the many games that have been uh, that are made available through on the Google Play Store. So it's actually like a more sophisticated but more user-friendly sort of Facebook sort of thing. I would say yes. Some mm-hmm. people would disagree. I completely agree with you. I think it's far more user friendly and it is just it's also just built for speed and built for business and efficiency. I, I just, efficiency which I am a huge fan of. Um Google Messenger we don't have a lot of time to talk about that, but think of SMS, texting, chatting all within your chosen groups they've built in. Nice. Um let me move on. So so I I've explained what it is and why it's important again it's mainly important because if you want to get found on google well they definitely take their google plus social network very seriously and will post your google plus stuff Mm. into standard google results and they're usually pretty high up too absolutely in the search list and that's a big deal people spend gobs and gobs of money and they often Forget about Google Plus, and it's, I can't believe that they often do it. But it's because a lot of people, I think, again, have placed stigmas mm. on on Google Plus, like, oh, it's only for nerdy people, and and it is just not true. Well, we have the Alex Jones show here uh, later, and uh, often he he always uh, says Google is a great big conspiracy, you know, to take over the world. This and that. <laughs> Tell me a company that isn't. Mm, that's <laughs> you true. know, Google. However, Google is one of their their mantras is don't be evil. And mm. that, that was a total shot at Microsoft. Mm-hmm. If you if you notice, everything that Google does, with the exception of advertising, 
is free. Mm. Everything they do. Microsoft, not so much. No, Basically, you pay so for much. everything. They're That's trying true. to keep up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, um, But they're in it to make money, $60 billion a year. Absolutely, they're in to make it, making money. But listen, they know that tons of people make tons of money mm -hmm. using their services for free. Right? So everybody wins. And with the numbers, the, the vast quantity of information and tools that they have, it's so easy to do target demographic specific especially for a business in google plus like that's exactly right that's why i'm talking about it i mm -hmm. believe wholeheartedly in google plus um some of the things that you can do to be uh, efficient and, and make more money um they take tagging people that you know the hashtag you can tag people you can also hashtag within your posts but they have taken a lot more uh time to develop each and every post where whereby you can format you can format your posts Hmm. It make them make them easier for people to read. Hmm. Right? You can you can uh, make, make the font bigger. Right, fonts. Well, the, the font. Excuse me. You can bold. You can make bullet pointed lists. Hmm. Um, add pictures, of course. Videos. I mean, they own YouTube. You can post all the YouTube videos you want in there, but the posts look a lot nicer. Mm -hmm. And again, with targeting, the, the posts just do a lot more than say a, a, uh, for you than say a Facebook post could ever do mm -hmm. for you. Um, the uh, they have communities full-on communities within google plus which are highly valuable and believe me there are tons of people there's over well i mean just in terms i think i've mentioned this number before in in a single year facebook excuse me um, google plus went from like 50 million users to 650 million users wow. in a single year wow. facebook took over six years to do that that's how powerful Google is. And they've gone way past that number. I don't really know what that number is right now. Wow. But it's there. And I see people joining all the time because the fact is many people have Gmail accounts. Well, guess what? You have Gmail. You really automatically have Google Plus sitting there waiting for you to fill out the profile. Which, by the way, if you're going to join Google Plus, spend a lot of time filling out your, your, your profile. Mm -hmm. As much information you can put out there about yourself and your business as possible because they're all keywords making mm -hmm. it easier for people to understand who you are what your business does and for other people who are you know typing in keywords into searches can find you right so because google will put those in the top of the search results for you for sure absolutely freaking mm -hmm. will. um so posting as i've always said post valuable content helpful information in the communities uh, it works people are passionate about whatever your photographer boy there's tons of photographers out on google plus mm. some of the pictures i've seen are just amazing around the world connecting with people just through photography amazing wow. i mean it's powerful maybe not as quite as popular in terms of only pictures as say pinterest but massive amounts of them and they do way more than pinterest when it comes to actually social socially networking so photographers have just posted um but just you know speaking of photography just posted so many of their uh, great pieces of art that they've made full-on businesses for the wow. right out of just posting their pictures and you know connecting with people other photographers or people who just love looking at an imagery the power of networking exponentially with google plus absolutely it's 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 mind-boggling at times um you can cross post all of your stuff from google plus to facebook twitter linkedin oh. all of that right oh, i didn't know that yeah mm. you can't especially you have to post it public but it's absolutely doable hmm. um let's see um they have a full-on events uh, within just like Facebook, they've got a killer set of, of events tools. So if you have an event coming up, definitely mm -hmm. post it on Google Plus and share it publicly. How are we doing on time? One minute. We got about a minute. Mm -hmm. All right. Let me race through my little list here. Um, da -da 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 -da. Well, let me go back to. I like always talking about um, you know leaving leaving people with a couple of thoughts. Um, try Google Plus. You'll you'll like it. It's not scary. It's, in my opinion, better than Facebook in many ways. Secondly, Google Plus gets better search results. Mm -hmm. Very important that you understand that, that if you're not on Google Plus, you're really shooting yourself in the foot for not getting, you know, not, not making more sales. Right, that search results are gold. They are really gold. People are paying through the nose. Um, as always, all of this stuff is available on my website, daveworks.net. Sign up for my podcast. It's right there, big button. You can subscribe to the podcast and on iTunes and next week I'm going to talk specifically about hangouts so we will see you next week talking about hangouts and I hope you have a great rest of your week Listen to the voice of the foothills am 950 KAHI Auburn Roseville Shingle Springs